how do we get into the the, the cow fiasco? What happened there? I because me and Bill were not there. Right, well, we we'd were, met we'd met up with well, not Trent and Heather, yeah. and we, we met we back walked, up at our truck. Yeah, at their truck, and yeah. then we were like, I "Wonder where you know Scott and Matt are," and and you actually called and Matt. I called Matt to see because because <laughs> they went to a corner, like the southwest corner. We went to the northeast corner, and we met back up at the the corner of this big piece. Like, yeah. right. So we seen each other, and then we turned and was going back to our right. trucks. So I'm like, well, we've seen each other in the back. And Matt's carrying field. a camera. Yeah, Matt's following Scott. Yeah. With Scout. Puppy, seven-month-old. Wire. Wire here. And when we seen him at the back corner, and we turned about the same time, so, like, I figured we should be back at our truck about the same time. They should be back at their truck the same time. And we had already been standing at ours for ten minutes or so. We're right. Like, well, I wonder where... And no one's here. Yeah, I wonder what Matt and, Matt and Scott are doing. <laughs> yeah, so I call, I call Matt. I said, how's it going? Oh, herding cows at the moment. <laughs> what? <laughs> He's like, oh, here he goes again. <laughs> All you can hear is stampede yeah. shit. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And he's, he's like, it's pretty intense. And he's like, I'm going shit my pants. Scott is saying this? Uh, Matt. No, Matt's Matt's yeah. Matt. Scott was cool as a cucumber. When oh, yeah. He so I would have had a Scott was walking like Clint Eastwood. Yeah, Scott didn't get it. Or, or Rowdy Yates. Like when Clint Eastwood played Rowdy Yates. Just <laughs> walk along the cattle. Mmm. So. Yeah, Matt was Matt was freaking out, and he goes, "How oh. scared were you, Matt?" Goes, I was pretty nervous because even when you look at the footage, it looks like they're further away. It looked like Blair Witch Project when yeah. you were carrying the camera. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> but like just how the cows were reacting to the dog, like they would they would run away and then they would kind of charge back in at the dog, oh. and they were scattered all out, kind of surrounding us. Yeah. I've never been around that many cows at all. Right, I was going to say. I didn't what? know what these things were going to do because they kept on charging the dog and I'm behind the dog. <laughs> <laughs> when you see it in footage, they're they're coming together. Like, they are they know yeah, what they're they, doing. Yeah. They're like they're herding up yeah. for group and yeah. numbers And they're or all something. staring right at Scout. And Scout's just staring them all in the eye. Roof, you would have... I would not you, have handled that very you well. You probably would have passed out. <laughs> I got to divert to a story. I don't know, 15 years ago, you were in Virginia with me. We're going goose hunting. We're going to go goose hunting. This is all right. We're going to go goose hunting. And this farmer tells us he's got a pond we can goose hunt. I know the guy from a gun shop. Roof and I get out there, and we figure we're going to put our backs up to her like a rock pile. Mm -hmm. And and we got some goose decoys out, maybe a couple. Well, we saw a truck pull up like a quarter mile away. Right. Well, the truck was, you know, cows, when the truck pulls up, it's time to eat. Yeah. Right? Yeah. We didn't know there was any cows in this field. But I also know, like, I don't have confidence around them, but I know they're cows. Yeah. They're, not, they're not predators, right? Yeah, yeah. Yeah. I didn't know that. I didn't know that. say non-cow school. I didn't know that. I didn't know that. How many cows were you dealing with? Oh, a dozen. Well, besides the, the big bull... I don't remember the bull. Big bull up there. I'd see the cows and the big bills look at me. I'm like, listen, dude, these ladies are not my type. So, you got you, 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 none, none, yeah, none of this. We're good. None of this. We're good. You see, my, I was worried about a bull, though. My experience was these cows were about like 40, 50 yards away. And there was what, like 200? It was a, it was lot, a lot of cows. A lot. It was a yeah. lot of cows. Like, and they were charging it, and I don't know what to anticipate. And you got to think. I, I instinctively went to high ground. Like, that's going to help. Yeah, I know. <laughs> I didn't know. What, it's like, what are you going to do? Yeah, you, there's no tree to climb. I, go, I can't go You got position. Yeah. yeah. So, but then at the hat trick. <laughs> yeah, just throw the hat. Get the cows out of well, here. Well, uh, that, that, I'll tell that one in a second what happened at that point when they all fronted at the dog, I right. was like, oh, oh man, <laughs> this could go really bad. I was, at first I was nervous for Scout, then I started getting nervous for me. I wasn't so nervous for Scott because he's just standing up there lobbying Yeah, he, he does not care. Yeah, and he's just like, oh, cows. It's <laughs> <laughs> from Texas, though. Yeah. And then all of a sudden, hurting all of them. <laughs> Through this valley is like a mini stampede. <laughs> oh, yeah, I wouldn't have done well. Just you wouldn't have done because they were pretty close to us. Because then we got up kind of on the rock. And no, they started like you started climbing up. The, it was a rock same pile. Thing. 
Rock pile was up. probably going up. <laughs> rock pile was probably 10, 12 feet high, very gradual. You know I'm how like farmers in Michigan, yeah, you, you get a rock yeah, over the years, you just yeah. make a rock pile. Roofs go like <laughs> rock by rock. Pretty soon, he's he's at the top of the rock pile. Yeah, I'm, and I'm still there. I'm like, I'm not cow confident, but I'm like, quit looking at me. Mm-hmm. Quit looking at me. But you can't help think about it. That's like an 800 pound animal. Oh man! Yeah. Like you thought, yeah. Matt. Like. They're, well, even if they didn't mean to run over me, yeah. once one of them run over me, the rest of them yeah. are just going to walk over you. 20 cows yeah. running over you. is like, yeah. And we lose the concert. camera. <laughs> yeah. yeah, you didn't have a gun to defend yourself. You had a camera. I had a camera, yeah, that's it. Oh, I probably would have shot the gun over their heads or something. I don't know why. All I did I that with them. All I can think is, like, that dog needs an e-collar. Now. Right now, yeah, we need we need control this dog. Yeah. We've also I seen said that to Scott too. I was like, you need well, to he's that. right on the edge of like, you know what I mean? Like, he's this seven is the months time old, he... but he certainly should be collar conditioned. So if something like that happens, yeah, then you can mm-hmm. not fry him, yeah, get his attention, yeah. Yeah. and he might think the cows did that, or and he'd be like, yeah. I'm good with that. He should have and, at least been wearing one in case of that instance, like right, that. yeah. And, and also, in case of chasing the deer and losing your dog. Yeah, exactly. That, that, that would be. Yeah. Oh, the hat trick. Oh, yeah, the hat trick. The hat trick. So we finally safely get back to the truck. Other, other side of the fence. Other side of the fence. We're by the truck. I'm feeling good now. Mm-hmm. All these cows are just kind of at the fence just staring at us. Yeah. Moving. Staring. <laughs> yeah, and then we Moving. can't get Scout back. And uh, I'm like, okay, I'm going to do the hat trick. So I take my hat off, throw it into the road. Like a frisbee. Yeah. Scout grabs my hat, goes back under the fence at the cow. Carrying <laughs> my hat. With your hat? With my and hat. chasing the cows with your hat. Now chasing. <laughs> Look what I got. Look what I got, cows. And I've already put the camera away at this point. Oh. I know. And, I, and I'm, like, I'm just like, God damn it. I'm going to lose my favorite hat for this month. <laughs> <laughs> I just got it. And uh, Scout was just tearing off at the cows with my hat and mouth. And finally, he, like, gets bored or I don't know what happened. He goes away from the cows. Mm-hmm. And for what, however it happened, um, Scout was able to get Scout out, out of the, the back, pasture back again. O- yeah, back over the fence. And I was able, and he still had my hat, and I was able and, to get the hat. Bill, we, you and I couldn't drive fast enough when we got the text. Well, you were when, watching. We, when we met up with, with Trent and Heather, right. we were, it was the end of the day. We were going to go back to, the, back to camp. Right. And we were pointed that way, and Trent and Heather were pointed this way. And when we yeah, were going, what happened? Phone, what yeah, happened, Trent? Like, oh, what's oh, going no, on? I'm going, oh, so, no, do you need our help or whatever? And you guys are like, what's, what's going, going on? on? What's going on? And Trent tells a story. <laughs> Stampede and scouts, <laughs> scouts, scouts herding cows. He's herding cows. And we go, Ooh, we turn around. We're around. Go, Let's go. We, we got to see this shit. See this. <laughs> <laughs> it's going to be funny. <laughs> <laughs> and what was funny is when we got up there, the cows were all still. Yeah, just yeah, there. Oh, they, had, the fence. they had the yeah. stink eye going. Yeah. Stay the they, out. There was like 200 cows stink eyeing us. Yeah. Like, and that's the last time we want to see you and yeah. your little dog yeah. in our yard. Yeah. In that hat. <laughs> How did you get your hat back? He, he, he had it in his he mouth. He kept it in his mouth. Yeah, yeah, natural bro. retriever. Yeah, horse good, bro, yeah. natural retriever. Good. good. Horse is great. Yeah, he's going to be a good dog. <laughs> We're in all sorts of technology. Was that Wednesday or Tuesday? We found that we found that field with Matt on Tuesday, and we shot out a covey, two coveys. Oh, that's hunts. right. Yeah. We found this piece. We Matt walked with Heather and I and Kip on the ground, and Kip was pointing off to my left, and Heather was back behind me to my right, and you know, I waved to Heather. I said, "Kip's on point over here." Waved her around. So as she's coming around to you know get in line with me to shoot behind Kip, yeah, covey explodes next to her. I'm like, oh shoot, like maybe two hun cubbies. Yeah, well, yeah, I didn't know that at the time. Just one too. went up, and right. Kip's still pointing over here to the left. I'm like, well, shoot, I think maybe, maybe they moved. Maybe he's smelling their roost. Maybe something yeah. funky. But so he was I turned really yeah, hard. He was hard. So wow. I thought it was weird too. So I turned like, and shot into that cubby that went up just for her flushing, and then when I shot, 
Kip's cubby went up. Oh. So there was two cubbies ah, of like a that. dozen plus. And wow. it was just, wow. just, if I had an auto loader, it would have been all over. Because <laughs> well, you couldn't, ha- couldn't keep yourself from <laughs> you dead yourself. That's why we use two barrel guns know, most of the yeah. time. And then mule deer, like it was crazy amount was of mule deer neat. in that place. Yeah. Kip was pointing from five feet away at the mule deer buck, and then Matt and I, we were walking, and all of a sudden, hey, poof, this thing pops up ten feet from us. We about shit our pants. This buck jumps right up, and then I see Kip. He's only five feet away from the bed, from where it was standing. Wow. And then as we keep, keep progressing through this field. I think we've seen more mule deer than birds. We've seen two bucks, two does, Real and then nice two deer, like yeah. yearling fawns that wow. still had their spots a little. They're really pretty. And you we know, had pushed a covey of sharp tail in there too. Yeah, we did find we didn't get a shot tail. on them, but we yeah. pushed them. So we knew, so we knew there, there was puns on sharp tails in this piece. Right. Um, it was off the beaten path a little bit. It was in the back, so we're like. Yeah, it was kind of like down a road you wouldn't go down. Yeah, a prairie. That's road. where you got to look at all the mm-hmm. mapping and all the mm-hmm. property lines because mm-hmm. these roads. Don't all they, they don't have a road to get they don't yeah, have they road don't road to get names. Yeah. yeah, so it it was off the beaten path and there was plenty of birds back there. The grass looked really great.